The more I worked on the piece, the more I felt I got to know him. We spent hours in the studio together. There was a lot of quiet, contemplative time, and we also had some great conversations. My name is Rosemary Pelaquin. I live in St. Pierre Jolie, Manitoba, and I sculpt wool. I start with clouds of carded wool and lovely wool locks. I use a tiny barbed needle to pull the wool tighter and tighter to give it strength and form. I make figurative art, mostly hands and faces. I got a phone call one day from the Canadian representative of the Campaign for Wool. It's a global endeavour operating in 12 countries to raise awareness about the unique natural and sustainable benefits of wool. As part of their 10th anniversary celebrations, they asked me to make a wool bust of their patron, His Royal Highness, the Prince of Wales. It's a great project to promote wool, a fabulous opportunity for me, and it is a bit daunting because you want to get it right. When I start a sculpture, after studying an array of photos, I have an emotion and perhaps a setting in mind, and the work builds from there. It's a slow, intimate process, a bit of a dance, a collaboration between the subject, the wool, and my hands. I wanted to capture the kindness, patience, curiosity, and knowledge that I felt, with, of course, that bit of a charming grin. I'll miss him when he leaves the studio, but I'll just have to find another face to felt.